Hi, this is Mickey Johnson here again at the uh, 2016 Denver Fly Show, and I'm here with Gary Border. Gary, Hi, it's nice to see you. Nice to be here. I know um, over the course of years that I've followed you and such, you know, as far as like with uh, fly fishing, as far as your tying of flies, uh -huh. you've had a broad variety of impact on people, and now you're doing a lot more with uh, people and teaching them like at the shows and such right. of uh, fly casting. Mm -hmm. What would you say to most people would be a basic outlook of what they should do if they're first getting into fly fishing? Well, casting, of course, is the most important part of fly fishing because it's the physical skill that, you, that is required in order to deliver the fly to the fish. So learn to cast and learn to cast well. I've been teaching fly casting now since 1973, so what is it, 43 years? Mm -hmm. 43 years actively on an international scene. And as I do and as I watch people and as I uh, interview other people and as I talk to other casters and so on, other instructors of casting, the single biggest problem always seems to be that people want to rush the process of learning to cast. They need to get basic casting down, get it down really well, and then from there they can progress to almost anything. Once they really understand casting and how to get the line out to go out, 40, 50 feet, no problems at all, then they can achieve almost anything they want from there. Sure. The other thing that I was kind of curious about, and I know I've always had this, when people come up to me and say to me, well, what should I buy as far as a fly rod and stuff? Uh, one of the rules of thumb that I guess I'm looking to get most people to think in terms of is, is maybe you should go and get some casting lessons first. Maybe you should go you know, and get used to what something is as far as a feel of a rod and what you may be looking for then you'll have a lot better idea of what you want to shop for. Yeah, that's part of it. Part of it is understanding what you need in terms of casting ability. The second one is also what you need in terms of fishing ability. Because you may want to go for tarpon, in which case you don't want a three-weight rod, you want a 12-weight rod. Yeah. You want to learn how to cast with a 12-weight. And if you're going for trout, you probably want a four or five-weight, maybe a six-weight. And, and you, then a different kind of situation is going to occur in terms of your developing your casting and so on. Sure. Because you're going to have to be a little bit more finesse and that sort of thing. So I would think more about, okay, what is it I want to do with this product? I just want to get into fly casting, period. If that's the case, probably you're going to be on the lower end, down in the four, five, six area, because most people go for trout, go for panfish, maybe catch a bass or two, and don't worry about things like tarpon, and don't worry about things like salmon and that kind of thing. Later on, they can get into catching uh, bigger fish and using heavier equipment and so on. All right, well, the, the other thing I really wanted to stress is, is like if people wanted to get a hold of, whether it be your books or other additional information on you, mm -hmm. where would they go to find that? Uh, they can find books and other kinds of things in fly shops and so on, but if they want to go online, they can go online at just my name, GaryBorger.com. There's instant information in there about the books and about DVDs and other kinds of things, and constant information being posted on things like Today's Show, yep. uh, Fishing Tips, fly tying information, places you can go, other people that might guide you, and so on. All kinds of information. I'm continually posting new information on, there, on, that, on that site, GaryWarder.com. Great. I've always uh, found you to be very informative, and I really like the difference you've made in the whole sport in general. But I thank you for your time. Thank you, Mickey. Thank Appreciate you very much. much.